mathematics on the topic how to solve the Venn diagram using set using set. But before we need to understand what is a set. A set, as it is expressed, written here, it is a collection of objects or things which have the common, the common. We have here an example. Let's form the set of the even number. But less than 15, 15. You need to understand what is even number. Even number are all numbers which is divisible exactly by, by 2. We have an example here as a collection. Let A will represent the set of even number, even number. So A will be 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, and 14. Because 14 is divisible by 2 and is less than by 15. We need to stop. Another example. Let's form the set of odd number. The set of ordinal, ordinal number. You need to understand what is odd number. Odd number is a number which is not divisible by 2. For example, but less than, less than, less than 10. Less than 10. So you need to come and write. And let letter B represents the set of all ordinal, ordinal number. Then here, as B will be 1 is excluded. 2 is not because 2 is an even number. We go to 3. 3 is an odd number. We go to 4 is not included. We go to 5. We go to 7. We go to 9. And we close. Are you understand, children? Yes, teacher. So let's go on. Let's move to this. Let's give you a, an exercise about this activity. Example number 3 will be done by a student. Example number three will be done by a student from, from the, the set of living things. Living things. Living things. From the set of living things. Living things. The solution will be done here. Solution. The here. Here. Are you ready? Yes. So let's go on to our today's topic. Let's go on to today's topic. Solving word problems using the Venn diagram. Solving word problems using the Venn diagram. Diagram. Example: In a certain lot of 100 pounds. 17 are good there and 45 have no pairs. Find the number that have got have do pairs only, have no pairs only. Let's pro provide the solution. Okay, a solution here. The hint is to read this question clearly and have to understand. We have the summation of house. All the summation will be written as the universal. The universal will be uh, will be 100, 100. We can we have the number of do do. Which if I say this, it's to represent this u as can be written as summation can be written as you as to say universal set. Universal, universal set. When I say, when I write this record, you mean, I mean that it is a unique set. A total number of a given set. And we have numbers, number of do that. Let's say red. Let also D represents represents represents